Hello everyone, welcome to this video. So now I'm going to show you how to remove bullets from a list. So right now, as you notice, uh, right here I have uh, three items. And each item has a bullet or a dot beside it. So we are going to use CSS to remove those dots. Now inside of my HTML tag, if I look at the code, I, I notice that I have the nav right here. And inside of that nav, I have an ordered list, and these are the items. So to target this, these um, items, I'll have to type in inside of the style at the head. So this is the head right here, and I opened style, and right here I can just type in my CSS. So I can say pound sign, well actually not pound sign, we are not going to use any pound signs. Uh, because uh, this is just uh, nav and this is ul so I can simply type in nav and then comes so it's nav here then comes the ul so then I can type in ul and then comes the li so just like that and open to clip braces so right now as you notice I can simply type in left so list dash style dash type colon none. So I did that. I'm going to save it and refresh it. So now if I refresh it, you'll notice that I have removed these uh, bullets. They're gone. However, you know, your in your case, you could have, uh, let's say that instead of this nav, you could have like a div. So if if you have a div, for example, you have a div with an ID of navigation. I mean, that's possible. You could have one. So instead of that nav, you could have a div. So right here, instead of typing nav, you're going to use the pound sign and navigation, then ul, and then li, and then you are going to just add the list type and you're going to set it to none. So now if I save and refresh it, it could be the same thing. And even though, you know, instead of ID, if you have like a dev with the class, class of navigation, let's say instead of ID, you have used the class navigation. Okay, so let's say that you have class of navigation. So right here, instead of using the pound sign navigation, you are going to use dot. Alright everybody, I hope you have enjoyed this video.